Every year at Bonnaroo, there's a new band that you've never heard of that just totally grabs you, catches you by surprise. This year for me, it was Cheer Up Charlie Daniels. With a name like that, we had to go see them, we had to talk to them, and they turned in a rockin' set on tap. Cheer Bonnaroo, thank you, we are Cheer Up Charlie Daniels. We'll be walking around. Thanks BMI again for getting us up here. And anybody else that I forgot, by the way, this band, The Givers, I saw yesterday. Everyone, if you've not heard them, check them out. They're fucking great. Not to this. Anyway. <laughs>
Hey, this is uh, Neil from Cheer Up Charlie Daniels. They just turned in a superior set. I think my favorite so far of the festival. Well, thank you very much. We, there was some great ones, so that, that really means a lot. So, ha have you ever had an interview where they didn't ask you about the name of the band? Not once. Uh, we're all actually illegitimate children of Charlie Daniels. Well, there were five original members. The two girls that we've added as of late, they, they're not. But we all moved to Nashville and didn't realize that we were all his progeny until we got there and we formed his band and we were looking for a name and that's just what came out of it. Why do you think he's so depressed? We don't think that he's depressed anymore, we're, but we're making sure that he never gets depressed. That's, that's pretty much the plan. Because if he gets depressed, I get depressed and then I know you really... We get really depressed if Charlie gets depressed, so... And a lot of people get depressed when they see us all depressed. That's true. The, but um, I think the whole nation would go down. They might. I mean, he, he supports those troops, and if we, we didn't have Charlie keeping the troops' morale high, who knows where we'd be.